me record that. So right now is super huge with people being in good moods. People, well, why don't you guys sell me? I've been telling you guys for weeks. Why is now so easy to sell Cutco? Bunch of reasons, like what? Presents. Christmas gifts. Christmas gifts. People are in good moods. People are in great moods. Christmas bonuses. Christmas bonuses. Um, time off work. Time off work. They're using their crappy um, knives during holidays. Exactly. On the same side, there's snow on the ground, right? So they there's a lot. They don't want to go out to eat all the time, so they got to cook at home. Yeah, they don't want to go to eat in the that. cold. So now is a perfect time to be selling Cutco. It's super easy. And I have some tips for you on that. And just know that with um, this time of the year, I don't know if you guys have seen like stats on like how much people spend around this time of the year with like Cyber Monday, Black Friday, and all that. I mean, you, you, guys, you guys could, could Google that now. But I think I heard there was going to be like 10 billion. Was it 10 billion? A lot of money, millions of dollars. For some reason, 10 billion. That doesn't sound right. 10 billion in sales in Cyber Monday? I don't know. It's a lot. It's a lot. In America? In America. Oh, that probably is about right. I have no idea. I'm just throwing, I, I heard something on the radio. There's umpteen people, and if they're all true. spending stuff that's more than a dollar. Yeah, true. There's 300 million in the US. Anyway, people are spending lots of money right now, so you want to take advantage of it. Um, so the great thing is, is you want to Christmasize your demo. What I mean by that, is you are the Christmas gift for them, okay? They have, they have all, you, you have all their answers, right? Think about the struggle. Struggle is real to find a gift sometimes. It's a hassle. You have to sit in malls. What is it? Yeah. So 9.4 billion last year. Yeah. So last year, Cyber Monday was 7.9 billion, it looks like. So people spend a lot of money, okay? So understand that we can be a piece of that. You can be a piece of that right now. People are looking for Christmas gifts. So you think about what Cutco is, right? It's the right size, it's the right color, it's elegant, it's sexy, everyone likes it. It's comfortable, usable, lasts forever, used every day. Think about what you, what's a gift you remember from five years ago? Let's hear it. Something you got as a gift more than five years ago. This watch. It's a horse. That watch. Jonas Fillers muscle t-shirt. Cool. So not many things, right? You can't think of many things. Think of how many Christmas gifts we got more than five years ago. You don't remember? You're not using it? Or it sucked, right? My, my grandma got me socks every year. It sucks. They are the crappy ones that don't stay up and they're like, it's just... It's bad. So, you know, think about it. Do you remember it? Are you still using it? Probably not. Okay. Um, so what's great is um, you can Christmasize your demo. So even if you are like Tommy doing a lot of virtual demos, you can still do this on your virtual demo. Okay. Here's some things you want to do. You want to get a holiday thermometer. Um, since we're doing this virtually for some of you, um, we can send you some. I don't think we have any in the office, but you can get a thermometer of a Christmas tree or like a candy cane and be able to like, draw, or you could draw one really easily and put your goal for December. That's what I would do because you're gonna make a new one for the Cabo push or for your January push. So for December, I want you guys to make a thermometer and make it a Christmas tree, make it a Santa Claus, make it a candy cane, whatever, okay? You want to wear a Santa hat, okay? What some people do, is they wear a Santa hat and they put their blue book in a red pillowcase and they show up like Santa Claus, okay? That's really fun. So um, you're able to, yeah, so, so you, you could totally do, do that. Make sure all your knives are in sheaths though so you don't get poked in the back, your back with a, a knife. But um, yeah, so act, act like Santa, wear a, wear a beard if you want, right? Even if you're, how funny would that be? If, uh, <laughs> Mrs. Jones told me hops on your Zoom call or your uh, Skype call and she sees you in like a white beard and a red Santa hat, right? Yeah, look good. Look good. You could pull it off. Um, 
but you could do like I know um you had reps that that put on like a red rain uh reindeer nose and like the antlers um so it's like a Rudolph uh, person some wear like guys sometimes wear like the Christmas ties um you can you can do like um you can do elf costume right you could do you could do a little plug in Christmas tree I know some people have a little like um you, know, you can buy the little Christmas trees to play music or they light up in your Miss Jones. I just need to make sure I do a demo by, by in, in outlets. So where's the best place in your kitchen where there's an outlet? Cool. You bring all your stuff. And then also you bring like a little Christmas, little Christmas tree and plug it in. That'd be kind of fun. Um, other things you're able to do. So that's Christmas sizing yourself. Christmas sizing your demo. One thing you can do is wrap up your blue book. Look at this. This is, this is my blue book from back in the day. This is mine from when I was selling like so many years ago. Look at this thing. Yeah. You guys who are here can see all this. Yeah. Wrap this up. This is like 50 year old, not, not 50. Oh my gosh. Like 10, How old are you, Jason? 10, 15 year old Cutco blue book, Jason. This is like back in the day. Look at that little testimonials. This is a whole nother day. There's a whole nother thing that we can show of how to do all that. But I had like thermometers, like it's getting hot in here. Look at this. Boom. Look at that. That's for my trip. So anyway, um, this is bad, but you wrap it up. You're Mrs. Jones, this is a gift for you. All your gifts are waiting inside of here. There's no pressure to buy anything, but most people do because they're getting all their Christmas shopping done um, now instead of beating, uh, you know, by beating the hassle of going to the mall. So Christmas size your demo by wrapping your blue book. All right, you could, um, you could play right now. You could put Spotify. You have a really cool like little in sync or Justin Bieber Christmas album list. Yeah, maybe, <laughs> depend on who you are, you get kicked out. But, you know, just bring up your phone, put a little Spotify list of maybe some Michael Buble. You know, maybe uh, a little- cookies. Yeah, bring, bring sugar cookies, cookies, sugar cookies, decorated cookies, um, anything like that. You just want to Christmasize yourself in the demo. It, it makes it more fun. And you guys heard Vern talk about this a couple weeks ago for the Punta Con or the the Cabo push uh, that, you know, during December, you want to Christmasize yourself. And during January, you want to like Caboize yourself, right? He said he wore like a sombrero on all of his demos because he's trying to win a trip. Um, so that's kind of fun. And um, so that's, that's great. So here are some, so any questions on that? Any other ideas you guys have for Christmasizing your demo or yourself? Okay. All right. Well. Yep. Um, I can I can send some of these lines out or um, not lines, but yeah, I can. I can send some of these out, but um, these are some ideas of things that you can add to your demo. And you don't want to add a lot to your demo, but during this time of the year, it's great to do it. So um, I would I would like I would say this every demo whether it's true or not okay and I'll, you'll understand what i mean by this so the line when you arrive at their house when you're taking off your shoes or you arrive at the door whenever you feel a good time is you say gosh this is jones i'm glad i made it on time my last customer wouldn't let me leave until she got all of her christmas shopping done oh by the way your last customer could have been three weeks ago you know it didn't have to be right before that demo. You didn't say the demo is just that today. You know, gosh, Ms. Jones, I'm glad I still made it on time. My last customer wouldn't let me leave until she got all of her Christmas shopping done. Yeah. Yep. So, you, so you're priming them, right? A lot, of, a lot of the demo is planting seeds and prepping them. So at the end, it just makes a lot of sense. Okay. Um, another key line that, that you guys can use. And again, I'll put these in the, in the group me. Um, Mrs. Jones, like I said on the phone, you don't have to buy anything. If you see some great gift ideas, which you probably will, I'm not going to stop you from getting them to today. <laughs> right? So you kind of already say that in the beginning of the demo of the, of the gifts. Um, at the forever guarantee, you can say something like, so Mrs. Jones, those gifts you still need to get are going to be extremely appreciated. The lucky people who receive Cutco from you will be using it every day for the rest of their life. And you know who they're going to be thinking of every time they use it, right? You. Forever. Right? So with the forever guarantee, basically planning that in like, hey, 
you got a ton of crappy gifts. We all have. You can have this be the best gift ever for somebody. Um, and then a couple more lines would be um, when you're making down a like list, um, whether they drop down to just pieces or they buy a set. Either way, when you go through the wish list, what you want to do is, um, you know, make some, make, make, make a like list, okay, and add a lot of things up. And the way you can introduce this around this time of the year is, all right, cool, Miss Jones, congratulations on your homemaker. You're going to love it. Um, by the way, we have a lot of gifts and accessories. And what I like to do at this point is have some fun making a like list, almost like a Christmas list for Santa. So if money were an option, you could see yourself adding, uh, what could you see yourself adding for yourself or as gifts, right? So whether you're at the end of the demo and they said no to everything or they just bought a set, you know, basically saying, let's make a like list for Santa as if you were for Santa and um, let's add it to, to your wish list, Mrs. Jones. Cool. And then the money line you have to say every time throughout the whole year, but especially this time with Christmas is how many, how many? So when they order a signature set, how many? The first time I learned this, some of you have heard this, but my customer Janice Brady, her son Colin I played football with, and I learned it at a Rising Star team meeting on a Saturday. That day I had a few demos and I used the how many lines. I'd never used it, but that's so great. And she bought a homemaker. Guess what I asked? How many? She goes, oh, my daughter's actually getting married this year. I might as well get her set too. Boom, two homemakers. So you also want to ask how many with everything, okay, from here on out. Um, so those are some money tips there uh, for Christmasizing your demo and yourself and some great mentalities and lines to use because people are going to be spending thousands of dollars on gifts anyway this time of the year. I might as well be in Cutco, right? So any questions on, excuse me, on, uh, on those lines or Christmasizing your demo?